Hi everybody and welcome to Spangly Nails YouTube. My name is Nicole and today's video is going to be a little bit different from what we're usually used to. I'm going to be doing a tag video. I wasn't tagged for this or anything like that. I just felt like joining in, you know. <laughs> so um, I've got my lovely friend Jessie's face here on my phone. I screenshotted it because she done it like ages ago and she the questions for this tag in her description box so that's why I was screenshotting it so that I had a note of the questions so in case I forgot to mention it because I don't think I have it is the confessions of a nail polish addict tag and it is 12 questions all related to polish that I answer and then I tag other people so let's go to the first question what color are you wearing right now none because I was ooh, going to um, film this video and then go and do my nails. So I'm naked at the moment. What nail product can't you live without? So I've came prepared and I'm choosing um, hand cream. And the one that I'm loving, still loving right now, is the Sally Hansen 18 hour moisturising hand cream. This is the one that I keep by my bed. You can see it's like peeling off. It's like almost empty. There's literally like that much left in it. It's suctioned onto my hand there. Look, watch. Oh, maybe not. That was immature. Anyway, that. <laughs> okay, next question. What is your favourite nail brand? I don't have a favourite. I can't pick a favourite because whatever, whoever's got the newest colour or the newest thing is where I'll like look at it and be like, oh, and or whoever's got like the like something new coming out, which they always do have. All the brands always have something new coming out. I'm always like, oh, mm, what's that? Mm, hello. Always. Next one was, what shape nail do you wear? Someone told me that you should follow the shape of your cuticles. My cuticles are really straight. That's why I wear my nails, my nails straight. And I think I suit that be like best. I prefer that anyway. On this hand, I don't care what happens, but this, these at least four always have to be straight. What's your go-to red, pink, and neutral nail polish? Um, I cheated. I came prepared. My go-to red is Nails Inc. St. James. My go-to pink, I'm also cheating because I'm bringing two. <laughs> my favourite pink is also OPI Kiss Me on My Chillips, which is the same as Jessie's. It's just really good. I've had it for ages and it works a treat. But my go-to light pink is Lily Road by Nails Inc. And it's one of the new white, so on camera it might be coming off like white, but it's definitely like a baby pink. And my go-to neutral, I'm cheating again. I'm bringing two. Because when I'm, I'm looking like for a, a, a neutral base for nail art, I always go to this bad boy. It is Coconut by Barry M Jelly High Shine range. It's an off-white, but like a nude. I couldn't forget about Porchester Square, which is Nails Inc's like one of their like best selling shades. And it's like a very mushroomy, taupey nude, but it looks great on all skin tones. So yeah, those are my those are my nudes. <laughs> Neutrals. Yeah. What number are we on? Number six of twelve, halfway through. I call Spanish juice. Okay, number six. Short or long nails? Short. <laughs> I really want her to expand on that. What nail polish colours are on your nail wish list? Um, I don't really have like a nail wish list just now. I'm more after stuff. So there's always like a new stamping plate that I'm wanting with a particular image on it. Or there's always like a new, this new chrome thing like out that I'm like, ooh, hmm, wonder what that is. I want to try that, you know? I did bring this down, which is the Nails Inc. paint can, because it was on my wish list, but then I got good as gold. So yeah, I think if I had to really pick another colour that's on my wish list, it would be some more colours from the paint can range. When do you paint your nails? Morning, afternoon or evening? Never in the morning. Never in the morning. I am not a morning person. I'm just gonna put that out there. I'm an afternoon or an evening person. So afternoon or, or evening. What is your top nail tip you swear by? I'm gonna sound like Jessie here when I say this, but don't cut your skin. If it's not coming off, don't pull it off. So yeah, okay, if there's a hangnail there, 
chop that bad boy, get it to France. But if it's not hanging off, then don't chop it, don't cut it, because I got a pair of cuticle scissors about two years ago, and I just went happy go snipping. And I have, for the last two years, suffered from serious infection and itchy and contact dermatitis on my fingers from infection getting in and under. And it has taken me this long to nurse them back to health and for my cuticles to regrow. Don't cut your skin. Ran over. What nail polish do you regret buying? I can't say like I regret buying nail polish because like when I walk in and there's like nail polish I'm like see ya I can look at nail polish you know I'm like go I'm like be like nail polish so like when I'm buying it it's like always a good idea at the time Ronald's always saying to me have you not got that colour I'm like no so for some reason the Sally Hansen complete salon manicure polishes never come for me they never come with a even brush there's always like one edge weirder than the other and I can't I feel like they take ages to dry like do they even dry because I've never had them on my nail long enough to know if they ever actually dry probably them because I've got quite a lot of them because they were in the pound shop at one point so yeah. neon or pastel pastel <laughs> what's your favorite color right now you wear all the time well if I had done this tag back when like Jessie done it and which was like, I don't know, about like nine months ago. If you'd asked me number seven, which was what colours were on my wish list like right now, I would have told you this colour. But now that I've got it, um, it, it effectively answers number 12 because it's like, what colour am I wearing like all the time right now? It is Nails Inc. Regent's Place. I wanted it for so long and now I finally have it. I actually have two bottles of it. I have the normal polish edition of it and I also have the gel of it. It is the most amazingly beautiful cornflower periwinkle blue. It makes my skin on my nails and my hands look really healthy. I just love the way it makes my fingers and my nails look. Ugh. I think that's all the questions. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I've done it. Woo! Um, hopefully that wasn't too bad and you weren't too bored. So now I have to tag people. Um, and I'm tagging anyone that wants to do it. If you want to do it, do it, and then you can tag me and let me know you've done it. I wasn't tagged, I just wanted to do it. I just came at the party and joined right in. So come and follow me on my social medias, they're all that spangly nails, apart from Snapchat, which is NLR1990. It'll all be down below for you. Make sure you check out my previous videos. Whilst you're doing that, be sure to subscribe to my channel. The button is red and you want to make it grey. Come and be a part of my team. It's fun here, I promise. But until next time, you guys, Bye! Whoa! My phone just dropped. Makes my skins... Skins? My skins, because I've got more than... Because, <laughs> yeah, I've got more than one skin. Um, yeah, I, whoop! Just gonna throw it. I love it so much. Um, yeah.